mansion, regular residential community, but Warren discovered his, his res personal residential home has $580,000 in equity. Is that a reasonable number to have in equity nowadays, mm -hmm. given where the values are going? That's not like exuberant. I mean, 580000 is pretty reasonable in a personal residential property right now. So Warren thought, oh, how can I use that $580,000? He went to a mortgage broker and the mortgage broker broke it down for him. We take your personal residence, we take the 580 in equity, we add $25,000 from your cash savings, and we set up seven lines of credit for you. What do you think these seven line of lines of credits are set up for? Down payments for his rent-to-own properties. Bingo. And that's how Warren started to stack. There's literally a stacking plan. I like it. It's a little stack. I like it. Um, so basically, Warren did seven rent-to-owns. And I put the year for full disclosure. I don't want to, to mislead you. This was not done yesterday. This was done mainly in 2017 and the early part of 2018. But he did them kind of back to back to back to back. He did a property in Alliston, Ajax, Brampton, Ottawa, Milton, Burlington, Kitchener. Average price, $479,000 between all of these RTOs. And when you add up how much cash flow he's making from each property, it adds up to about $5,000 in cash flow. He's making $60,000 a year from all of these rent-to-own properties. Yes, he's borrowing from a line of credit. Yes, there's a HELOC component to that. Yes, there's a cost of borrowing to that, absolutely. I don't know the exact specifics of how much he has on every line of credit. That, that part would be a little bit more difficult for me to calculate. But is that interest a write-off? The HELOC line of credit money he's using is a write-off. So there's tax efficiencies in borrowing from your own equity or from your own line of credit. So this gave Warren peace of mind that Ramona can now leave her job because he's offsetting her <coughs> job income with cash flow. And they never have to deal with the tenants and toilets. So that's Warren's approach. So that's how you can stack the strategy because we are doing all the heavy lifting and he's plugging into our systems. Warren never had to go, he no, I don't think Warren even stepped foot into any of the properties that he owns. He completely defers to our turnkey prof, uh, process.